Hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to go through some of the celebrities' most inappropriate moments when they go on talk shows. But before we get into that, don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos of your favorite celebrities. Now, let's get into it. When rapper Kanye West appeared on TMZ to explain why he decided to wear hats that supported former President Donald Trump, he ended up getting into a rant that left people feeling uncomfortable. In that rant, he admitted to being very drugged because of his liposuction surgery, and his rant was so loud that he made all the employees scared. I'm taking two, hey everyone listen to this please. Two days before I was in the hospital, I was on opioids. I was addicted to opioids. I had plastic surgery because I was trying to look good for y'all. I got liposuction. During an X Factor segment on the UK version of the show, one of the judges, Louis Walsh, was called out on live television for harassing Spice Girl member and judge Mel B. Louis didn't stop after he was caught the first time and inappropriately touched Mel again to everyone's shock. When Jason Momoa appeared on the Jimmy Kimmel show to promote his new movie Slumberland, he had a surprise for the audience. He stripped down to a traditional Mallow attire on stage, which he had worn before while preparing for a movie role, and it got a big pop from the audience. So. When James Corden hosted the Amphar Gala in 2017, he made some jokes that didn't sit well with anyone in the audience. Corden made an inappropriate joke about Harvey Weinstein during the Cinema Against AIDS Gala, which gave him a lot of boos. And the crowd didn't get the laughter that he expected. Right here in LA, it's so beautiful, Harvey Weinstein has already asked tonight up to his hotel to give him a massage. I don't know whether that groan was that you like that joke or you don't like that joke. If you don't like that joke, you should probably leave now. When Jessica Biel appeared on The Graham Norton Show, she was joined by Hollywood actor Mickey Rourke. The Top Gun actor, however, seemed intoxicated and ended up acting inappropriately on stage, and even had the host Graham calling for help at one point. Say hello, hello on the couch. Come on, come here. Oh, bless you. Oh. You see yourself down there? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Help is on its way. Good, all good. You're okay. Hey, hey. You, 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 you mind your own business okay. over there. <laughs> Sophia Vergara appeared on the Jay Leno show alongside Gordon Ramsay, and she was shocked by the celebrity chef's ruthlessness towards her. Gordon Ramsay behaved like a child throughout the whole interview. Now, what did you have there? It looks like you got the uh, it's pizza. What do you mean? What is that? No, wait, but once you haven't heard of a knife, <laughs> knife and fork, no. <laughs> you don't you, eat pizza with a knife and a fork. You just pick it up and stick it in. Of course, you have to take it. Like <laughs> Whoopi Goldberg has been one of the hosts of The View for a decade, and a lot of things have happened to the actor while she has been on the show. Whoopi had an embarrassing moment whilst interviewing Claire Danes, where she farted on live TV, but luckily everyone laughed it off. Our identity was really questioned, and I think it, it explores that in a really smart way. Um, well, you know, you, oh, I was gonna say, yeah, you're so high. Oh, excuse me, I have no differential. I think I just blew a little frog out of there. Conan O'Brien had an inappropriate moment with Pussycat Doll singer Nicole Scherzinger when she appeared on his talk show to talk about the X Factor. When Conan kept staring at Nicole's breasts, she had to cut him off and call him out, which caused the host to make a scene in front of everyone. <laughs> you look fantastic. Thank you. Yes, you look so beautiful. That is an incredible dress you're... <laughs> that you've been dipped into. Uh... <laughs> With it's your been, tie. What's that? It goes well with your tie. Yeah, we go very well together. <laughs> yes, let's get closer. 
The View is a talk show which has been around for decades and it's had its own fair share of embarrassing celebrity moments. When Danny DeVito came on stage, he admitted to drinking all night with George Clooney before behaving very drunk and almost leaking the entire plot for his upcoming movie. Every available light from the town, from the next town, from the next town, I find horses, I put them in oh, front of the house. Oh, don't the home, Ari, it's okay. Come here, sit with mommy, come here, honey. Yeah, come, come sit with me. Come You're okay. You're okay. You're okay. Jimmy Kimmel sometimes asks his guests inappropriate questions, and they make them feel very uncomfortable on the show. When Margaret Qualey went onto the show, Jimmy asked a question, a pretty weird one. He asked if she grew real armpit hair for the film, or used wigs on the set of Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Yes. You have armpit hair, is that your real armpit hair, or is it like little wigs there in, in the inside? <laughs> no, real I armpit. can really, I guess, grow a lot of How long did it... Is there, did you shampoo that and condition, or is it, uh... <laughs> Or are you just just a um, bar of soap? I just did the soap thing. Just the soap, but yeah. I, maybe I should have conditioned. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I, um... Actress Gal Gadot went on The Conan Show to do press for her DC superhero movie Wonder Woman. However, she quickly became uncomfortable after Conan began asking her about her breasts before asking her out. Well, trouble is, she's happily married. Uh, there were comments that they wanted like, oh, we want her to be more bosomy. Uh, yeah. That was a bigger heart. Bigger heart. Yeah. yeah. I'm talking about frustrated nerds online. I think you look <laughs> absolutely stunning, and thank I'm you. happy to take you to dinner anytime. Uh, <laughs> thank you. I have a husband, but I don't have a boyfriend oh. yet. Oh, good. So we'll Whoopi's appearance on the Graham Norton show was filled with a lot of laughs because of what she was talking about. While seated alongside Keanu Reeves, she began to inappropriately talk about her pubic hair, which made everyone on the couch cringe. Can you say pubic hair? I can say pubic hair. Pubic hair? Yeah, oh yes! <laughs> Once where there was an afro... <laughs> right. ...that I could put beads on and braid. <laughs> wow. There is now Paul Schaefer's head. <laughs> Okay. Okay, empty bald. There we go. <laughs> but there's more to it, but you have to come. When Rihanna went onto the Jimmy Kimmel live show to promote her new music, the host suggested they do the Twizzler challenge for autism awareness, but it made the singer a bit uncomfortable. Jimmy took out candy and pushed Rihanna to reenact the scene from the film Lady and the Tramp. She was so uncomfortable doing it that she called out Kimmel's wife's name before they started. Put this in my mouth and uh -oh, we will just. Molly! Yeah, Molly's gone. There is no more Molly. And then we just eat our way. There you go. Jimmy Kimmel and Gal Gadot had an inappropriate moment together when the actress spoke about her breasts that had become an issue with some Wonder Woman fans. Jimmy's response to Gal's question, however, was good that it made the awkward moment before forgettable. Seriously, comic book nerds take this kind of stuff because I am one of them. Really? Yes. What do you think about my breast? Um, what? <laughs> <laughs> they no, look no, great. They're yeah, both of them. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. No, no, no. I was. Mark Wahlberg's interview on The Graham Norton Show went horribly wrong after he drank a little bit too much backstage. While being interviewed, he couldn't keep his hands to himself and inappropriately began touching a guest and even sat on Graham Norton. My dad had a, had a, um, <laughs> a retail store, a discount women's clothing store called Crazy Sophie's Factory Outlet. It smells <laughs> so good. Uh -huh. You sit there. <laughs> <laughs> when Kristen Stewart went onto the Stephen Colbert show to promote her latest film project, Personal Shopper, she didn't expect to feel so uncomfortable. Stephen reached out to Kristen and fixed her mic so that he could hear her properly, but his hands lingered inappropriately on her chest and you could see how nervous she became. Can I just do one thing here? I just want to take this mic and Put this and maybe adjust your mic slightly. We're gonna cut this part out because it's a little too intimate. Wow. But your chain, <laughs> your chain, if you don't mind, your chain was hitting your mic and we couldn't hear you. Did you get a, did he tell you, did you have a little earpiece? He just looked at me and when he pointed at the prompter and the prompter said, chain on mic. Got it. <laughs> that inappropriate moment brings us to the end of today's video. Which one stood out to you the most? Share it with us down below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more celebrity videos just like this, and we'll see you in the next one.